what's going on everybody jake the happy snake here and welcome back to jake wants to be a millionaire yesterday i got the 5,000 euro question wrong so i won 3,000 euro for the second straight episode that was converted to three thousand dollars and that brought my overall total to fifty million five hundred nineteen thousand eight hundred and forty three dollars so this is episode 812. Now, over the last year and a half, any episode that has had the number 12 in it has been fantastic. Episode 412, I won the million dollars on the Australian Game Boy Advance version of Millionaire with my friend Ben, aka Zero Xerox. Episode 512, I won the million dollars with my brother and my dad. Episode 612, I won a half million dollars, and I would have won the million if I did not switch the question. And episode 712, I won a quarter of a million dollars thanks to guessing on the quarter million dollar question like i like it was a complete flat out guess on the 13th question and i ended up getting it right so yeah i mean the last four episodes to end in the number 12 have been just amazing so i'm hoping to keep that uh, that streak going today with episode 812 and because I've only been playing Millionaire in Italian for a couple of weeks, I decided for today and today only to go back to English. And not only that, but I'm going to be playing today's game on Easy Mode. I am very familiar with Easy Mode. I, I played this mode so many times. I won the million dollars five times on this difficulty. And now, it's been a while since I've consistently played on Easy Mode, but... This is still going to give me a decent opportunity to do really well today. And it's been a while since I've won the million dollars. It's been, I think, it's been exactly 178 episodes since I've won the million dollars. And I believe that it's the longest I've gone in the entire series without winning the top prize. So, I want to try to win it today. I'm going to do everything in my power to win it today. But tomorrow I'm going back to Italian. So, I just got to take it, you know, one question at a time. Let's do this. The number 12 has become the opposite of the number 23 for the series. Here we go. First question for $100. Which of these is a hero in a, cha in a children's book series? Uh, Naughty. Okay, that's $100. Going now for $200. How many days are there in a week? Well, according to Montana's, there's eight days, but uh, yeah, it's it's B. All right, three hundred dollar question. What comes after winter? Ha! Ah! Well, in Canada, it's actually winter again. Um, or no, you know what? I like this one, the Ice Age. No, um, after winter is spring. Okay, $300, and now we're going for $500. With what do you cut food? Okay. $500, and now for $1,000. Which of these animals is not nocturnal? D. Yeah, because I've, I've, I, I got that wrong, actually, in uh, f episode 423. It, it was an episode that ended in 23. I think it was 423. Okay, going for $2,000. When an animal does not eat other animals... Herbivorous. Okay. 2000 Okay, let's take it one question at a time. We're going for $4,000 now. Inhabitants of Peru are called Peruvians. Like the Peruvian puff pepper. All right, 4,000, very good. Here we go now for $8,000. How many Musketeers are there really in Alexander Dubas, uh, The Three Musketeers? Four. Don't be, don't be fooled by The Three Musketeers. Okay, that's 8,000 bucks. We still have all four lifelines. We're going now for 16,000. Gotta be careful. There's the biggest snake in the world. The red, the, the D. Yes! That was kind of a, that was a little bit of a guess, I'm not gonna lie. Woo! Okay! 
Okay, going for 32,000. Who became king of England in 1066? That would be William the Conqueror D. Final answer. And that is how you do it. First 10 questions out of the way without using a lifeline. We are in great shape all of a sudden. Five questions away from the million. Still have all four lifelines. Here we go for $64,000. I cannot be reckless here. I think it's Cardi B, but I'm not prepared to make that risk, so I'm going to phone a friend. Don't know if I'll be able to trust the phone a friend. I'm trying to think. It's not Dua Lipa. I don't think it's Lil Kim. We're going to call Tina. <coughs> Come on, Tina. I need you to give me the right answer. I don't want to have to use an, uh, another lifeline on this. Cardi B, D, but it's risky. That's good enough for me. Cardi B, final answer. Yes! I did not have to use the phone a friend, but I'm glad I'm, I'm glad that I uh, wanted to play it safe. Okay, that's 64,000. Four away. Three lifelines left. We're going for $125,000 right now. That is a demonstrative pronoun. Final answer. Boom! Woo! This is getting good. $125,000. Three lifelines left. Three questions left. We are playing for a quarter of a million dollars. In horseback riding, what is a lunge whip? Okay. I will be honest. I am not sure if I've seen this question before. If I have, I've only seen it once, maybe twice at the most. Um, I'm definitely not going to take this risk. I'm going to switch the question. I guess I can see what the right answer is, but I mean, I, I don't play on easy mode on a regular basis anymore, so it's not really going to do me any good. It is a long range whip. All right. Good to know. Here's the new $250,000 question. Still have two lifelines. Which artist painted the dome of the Sistine Chapel in Rome? I don't know. I have a strategy on this particular level that I've done in the past and it's worked. I think it's I think I only failed once, um, and I had I have the means to do it because I have the two lifelines that I need, which is the phone with the, the excuse me the the ask the audience and the fifty fifty. But that means I have to use three lifelines on this one level, and I really don't want to do that. But I don't know how else I can get the right answer to this. So I'm going to ask the audience. Wait a second. That was an error. I'm not supposed to do that. I'm supposed to 50-50 first. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I, I definitely may. I, I misplayed that. 43, 26, 17, 14. 43, 26, 17, 14. Okay, well, so it's not going to be A. Um, hopefully it doesn't leave C and D. Raphael, final answer.
Well, not very often is the majority of the audience actually right uh, at that late of a level, but it is what it is. $32,000 is what I win. That brings my overall total of $50,551,843. Guys, thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I will see you back here tomorrow where I will be back to playing this game in Italian. Thank you everybody for watching and peace out.